How's it going guys? It's Poetry Set and welcome back to another episode of Steel Division Normandy 44 where we will be trying once again the Pegasus Bridge mission. This one has been giving me some trouble. I failed it twice now. Um, so I want to make sure this time instead of I, I think last time I was on the right sort of track there but I need to be either quicker about it or just better about it. Um, with our plan here, and so I think we just kind of need to look at stuff for a second. I need to stop rushing so much and look at stuff. Yeah, we don't need to watch this. Um, we must secure those bridges without delay. Yeah, I got you, dude. Prepare the commandos reinforcements. Okay. Mm hmm. Basically, huh? Compose your battle group. I want to look at the map first. So what I'm thinking is, I wonder if perhaps it's actually a better idea to try and like push up on this side. Like that seems kind of ridiculous, but I don't know. It could be the better option. Uh, I'm just thinking. I think that would take too long though. That's the main problem there. But assuming we're able to do that, we could cut off the people on this side easily, get an anti-tank over here looking down this way. <sighs> Maybe we should try that. We'll see. We'll see. In any case, let's focus on this first. So, once it stops lagging out... Um, okay. We will face a great number of elite paratroopers. Yeah, I, I've listened to you. I'm just going to ignore him and get through this. Um, I think we need these things, and uh, these things are also pretty good. I actually didn't even realize this, but leaders are a lot better than I thought, because they actually raise HP, they make it so that if you get surrounded, they still fight like normal. Uh, leaders are actually pretty important, I think. I think I haven't been giving them enough credit. Then in the next part, I just need more, I believe. We have received some veteran Panzer IV and tank commanders. They are more powerful than any allied armor in the sector. Yeah, something like this, and then get three minor tanks. Panzer IV C and SCW yeah. 233 with their short barreled 75mm guns. Flamethrowers are very useful. I think this is what I want to do for that. Mm, I want more bazookas. They were actually quite useful last time. Two in the early game. For late game, or, you know, phase B. Um, we do need guns, I believe. Uh, we need more guns. And we need to make better use of them, really, is the main thing. Uh, flak is important. I think it'd be good to get these things. I'm just gonna take one for now. Our artillery can weaken the enemy defenses around the bridge. We can also suppress or even destroy enemy guns once we have mm -hmm. spotted them. So we need this... These things are good to have early on. After that, I think it would be good to have... These things do have armor piercing, actually. But I think I'd rather have, like, more just, you know, launch in artillery from afar. And the air. Uh, I think... I think I want these things lighter, and they're also available early on. And I think that'll actually do it for us. Uh, I'd rather have two planes. Is there anything else we can do without? I think we don't need the flamethrowers as much, because I don't really use them very well. <laughs> the ME, this one's not very good. Let's go for these, which are a good middle point. Alright. Alright, uh, let's do this. However, I do want to take a second here. I went through that kind of quickly, but I do want to take a second here before we start to actually look at the map a little closer. Uh, what, is, what have we learned? Well, this area right here is just deadly. It's a death trap. If you move troops up to... Uh, every time I move troops up to this area here, normally, you know, this sort of tree cover does well. However, they just bring in infantry through here. They bring in, like, tanks through here. They have tanks all the all, you know, and... Um, half tracks lined up along here that just shoot you uh it's it's not good um beyond that if we come up here they'll have infantry and bazookas lined up along here that's i think easier to deal with and that is our i think the route we want to take for our final attack however it's not really been feasible in the past to do that right off the bat it has seemed seemed unfeasible um every push we've done in this area has pretty much failed 
Uh, on this side, we've had a bit more luck. And that's kind of why I'm thinking maybe we flank them from further out. Come over to here, to this village, set up some defenses overlooking this area. And then just kind of wait them out for a little bit. It seems like it could work for me. Or in my opinion, in my opinion it seems like it could work. Um, I think over here we want some recon. I think we also want some recon over here. That's all for recon right now. Um, we of course do need to hold on to this area here. That's going to be one of the difficult things. Hold on to it without putting too much effort into it. I think with two infantry we should be able to do that. And maybe... Maybe one of these things as well on this side. Um, maybe one more infantry actually. To be safe. But then the rest of it I think would be good to... I do want to try to do this strategy. Uh... Maybe it'll fail miserably. It might. There's a good chance that it could. But uh, but I think we gotta try it. We have to try something different. Um, I'm gonna put a, a tank over here with you guys as well. That's basically all we can afford. I want you guys to bum rush to here. Um, you guys, I want you guys to basically spread out and have a defense system over here. You're going to come up to, like, here. And that way we can set up the leader now to come to here. Did I do the wrong one last time? I think I might have. Um, I want you to go ahead and come over to here. I want you, Recon, to come over to here, as well as with you. And that's all we have, really. Oh, we have this uh, this recon here. I want you to go there. All right, cool. Let's see how this works out, uh, and let's get right back into it. I'm ready to try again. It's been a couple days since the last session. I didn't really mention that. I did not get you to come anywhere. Not good. The units that broke through our lines at Saint Gobain have been spotted near the bridge. They won't make things easy for us. The British have turned the bridge garrison's pack forty anti tank gun against us, and they have the cheek. To yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah playing, playing fair, whatever. Fair play. Okay, I want you guys to come over to here. So, tank, come over here. You drop off your troops in this one. You drop your troops off in here. Oh, here's the only thing. We have more troops coming on this side. That's okay. We can make it in time, I believe. I believe. Could put them here. Yeah, you know what? Let's put these guys here. Is that the leader? That's a leader. Never mind. Yeah. Get back in there. Hop back in. That's not a good idea to do what I was going to do. Uh, and then come over to here. You come over to here. Actually, move up to those buildings. Cool. Uh, you guys move up to here. You guys move up to here. Leader is getting them all in his effective range, and that's really what I care about. I don't really care about too much else beyond that. Uh, you guys all sort of station up here. And that should hopefully be good. Okay. You guys don't really have any vision right now. That's unfortunate. Uh, come over to that side. See how that goes. Um, phase B in seven minutes, and that's about when the that's when the enemy reinforcements will come too, though. So that's unfortunate. Yeah. So recon here. If we use our recon and whatever correctly, we should be able to totally destroy these infantry. Like that's the hope, at least. Recon won't be able to do much damage on their own, but if we get uh, get our things in here, should be able to do some damage, you know? Okay, they did have that, that artillery over here, and I want to destroy it.
I'm flying over. Where is it? I know it's gonna be here. Somewhere here. Might not be there yet. In which case, I'm sure we can find other stuff to destroy. You don't have any vision. There you go. Destroy it. We see where it is, roughly. Come on. Does it really take you that long to turn around? Okay. Alright, we destroyed that guy already. That's real good. See, this is what I was uh, hoping would be able to happen. Is like being able to do stuff like that pretty quickly. Okay, over here. So this is the interesting thing. Now that we made it to here, we should we should start pushing up with these things. Um, we don't have any more infantry for this phase, of course. We got to be careful with what we have, essentially. Actually, you know what? I want you guys to leave your building. You guys come out to here. You guys move to here. Okay, here you go. Yeah, you're repairing that ship there. I'm there. Ship, yeah, no. Uh, the plane. And I do think we want to go ahead and get an anti-tank thing over in this direction as well. Right now. So we're going to need it. We're not going to be able to... We can already pretty much tell we're not going to be able to complete this without reinforcements, enemy reinforcements arriving. So let's uh, go ahead and, you know, not hope for that. Uh, come on, come on. You should be able to get a line of sight on that pretty quickly here. That's a Pac-75. You need to destroy that right away. Come on. You have to destroy it. Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. How how terrible can you possibly be? Yeah, come over here where you're still behind these tr this tree line here. You come over to here maybe. We need artillery though. Uh... Yeah, 30 seconds till we get artillery, till we can get artillery. And you guys have a pretty good position, but you're gonna need some help here. That's what we should bring these in for. There you go, there you go. Come on, you got so many lines of sight. We're using cover here, actually, in a way that I think is pretty beneficial. And now we have line of sight on this guy with our plane. There you go, there you go, there you go. You can take this thing out. Uh, I think you should, like, line up your gun right over here. We destroyed the machine gun. Look at that. Wait, a different machine gun. Where was that one? Interesting. Uh, okay, I, still, I think that's doing all. It's doing all right. We're doing all right in general here. Okay. Artillery or anti-air? Which one should we get first? I think we'll go artillery. Okay, there you go. Okay. Enemy contact with who? Not sure. We are getting good intel on them and whatnot. I don't know, we just gotta... What are you? Huh. Okay, interesting. I do think we should move up here. I think we have enough suppressing fire that we should be able to move up. Without too much problem. Too many problems. Yeah, 
Yeah, this is the problem here, is that these things are gonna start destroying us. Uh, air. Do we have another air thing? Please, go and destroy those things. We destroyed a flamethrower, that's real good. Come on, you got it, you got it. They're so close, they're so close. Get your shot lined up. Get your shot lined up. You got it, you got it, you got it. You can destroy them. They're right there. They're so close that you should be able to get some really good hits in on them. They're all pinned down now, basically, so that's good. And, uh, yeah. Like, this is going well right now, but... We're gonna have to... I don't even know what we want to do with these, with this anti... I want you to set up your gun, like, like here. Oh, no, no. Wait, wait, I forgot. There's an anti-tank gun. That's why we weren't going out there. Wow, look at that. Phase B is going to start soon, which is bad, because it means enemy reinforcements, but... Uh, it also means we get more troops and whatnot. And uh, I think we're doing better than we've done any time before this. However, it's still not going perfectly. We still have uh, negatives. There you go, there you go. You guys got this. Oh, that's a lot of dudes, huh? Come on, you guys got this. You guys got this. Yeah, there you go. We gotta destroy that thing. We gotta destroy those bazookas or Okay. That's okay. British commandos don't scare me at all. I mean, well, that's a lie. Uh we do have our our other troops now. Uh let's go ahead and get get ready to go here. Hey, commandant. See, this is the bad thing. Yeah, you guys are going to get destroyed. Back up, back up, back up. Now destroy them. No! I'm so pissed. I, this is what I hate about <laughs> that situation there. And there's all their tanks. Did our gun get destroyed already? Oh, I'm so mad about that. That makes me pissed off. Okay, there's so many troops here, so many enemy troops here. Artillery, we get better artillery now. Get over to there. We need a tank. Uh, as soon as the next tick comes, we'll get a tank. Could certainly be better right now, but it's certainly not going terribly either, so that's good. Uh, go ahead. I think you need to come to, to here, actually. Start readying for pushes on this side. Okay. Get you guys to come over here. Oh my god, there's so much fire going on right now. There you go, look at that. Look at that. Tank. We need a tank. Let's get a Panzer IV H. Get a big boy in here. Come on, you guys can make it to that building there. Oh, look at that. We're actually doing all right now. You guys made it in there. Good. You guys move up to here. 
Keep pushing up. Keep pushing up. Press your advantages while you have them. Oh. <laughs> Satisfying. Hey, you're hitting us! <laughs> Stop that. Friendly fire. That's friendly fire. Okay, if we can just hold on to this position now, we should be able to do pretty alright. There's so many of them, though. There's so many of them. Okay. Well. Then we start pushing, start preparing for a push on this side over here. Alright, and at this point I'm just going to let these guys kind of sit as they are and, and do whatever they can do. I do think it'd be good to have maybe one more set of infantry up here. Well actually let's move them from here. You go here, and then maybe you come up to here. Because this thing should be able to do some real damage. There you go. You guys move up to here. Artillery, this is your time to shine. You see that target there? You see how many there are there? Yeah, I just hit that general area there, and you'll be able to destroy them. Oh, this is so intense! Look at this huge battle here. I mean, it's working pretty well, I feel, like, to give myself some credit. I think this plan, actually, to push from the right side is actually kind of helping. Maybe not a ton, but it, I think it's helping a bit. At the very least. Actually, destroy that one first, yeah. Oh my god, they destroyed the tank. Darn it. It's not good. We need We need another one over here. But, uh, we don't even have that many good tanks, though. Uh, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Again, you do want to... I want you to target those guys. Okay, well, this is actually a good distraction, if anything. If nothing else, rather. Uh, it's a good distraction. Now, while we're distracting them, bring in our troops over here and start pushing. It's time to start pushing. Yeah, you need to. I, mean, I need to make sure to get you to come over here. I'm gonna kind of just let these guys go as as best as they can, survive as long as they can. Because uh, while I don't expect them to hold out forever, they just need to buy us enough time. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Destroy those guys. There you go. We just got to keep doing that. Keep doing that. Okay. Of course they got this thing over here now. Uh oh, that's not good. I just sent out a plane when I when that happened. You probably hit him. So that's good. We'll have to hope that it did enough. Uh, we do need more recons over here. Okay. 
Okay. There you go, there you go. We just need to make sure they can't sneak up on us with any of their bad things. There you guys go. Come on, you got this. Yeah, hit this general area there. I think we need more artillery. Just bring more artillery in and we're just going to push with everything we got over here. We have to try. We have to try. Come on, once they get in your range, you just destroy them. Don't let him cross this bridge. If we can just hold the bridge, we'll be actually fine. Starting phase C now, huh? Did that say bloody tater? Okay, here we got this. We got this. There's so many of our guys here. We can't fail. We must do it. For the success of our country. Yes, I'm Zomin. I'm just kidding. Uh, yeah, so our defenses have fallen on this side. That's okay. They provided the distraction that I believe we needed. There you go. Destroy that gun now that we have sight on it, finally. Okay. Uh, one of you. One of you do that. One of you do that. One of you do that. Okay, we need anti-infantry, so like some some flamethrowers would be good, a Panzer C would be good, you know, we just need everything. Okay, you guys go over there, I want you to bring your flamethrowers up to here. Come on. I want you guys to move up, if anything. Should be able to do that. Start moving, start moving. Come on, you guys got this. We just gotta keep pushing. Target them with all three artillery. This should be good. Come on, you guys got this. There's one set. 
Both of our Panzer Grenadiers just got destroyed. However, they should be absolutely destroyed. <laughs> Come on. They're bringing like a tank in over here. I don't like that. We need some uh, some bazookas actually. Now that I think about it. Yeah, drop them off, drop them off. This is the flamethrower, so flamethrowers, you need to move under the cover of the trees. And if you can just get over there, you should be good. Darn it. When do we move up with our big tank? That's the question. Hold on, I'm gonna minimize OBS because I think it's lagging my computer a bit to have it. We're destroying so many of them, but don't know if it's enough. Oh, that one just got destroyed. You're out of ammo. Uh, it looks like our our ally should actually help us with that automatically, which is very nice, actually. It's a nice feature. Come on, you guys got this. You guys got this. We just gotta push up with everything we got all at once. Yeah, that's bad. So there's a tank here we need to deal with. I know! I'm trying, dog. I'm trying. Flamethrower them! Destroy! Flamethrower! Flame them! Holy crap, man. They're falling back. They're falling back. Suppress that one. Suppress that tank. you can suppress that one, then you'll be good. Okay, we gotta try something. There you go. Can you guys hit that spot there? Destroy that freaking artillery thing. It's been a pain in my side this whole time. Destroy that tank. Now! Yes! There we go. Come on, you just need one more shot, one more shot. Stop it! Why is there so much fire here? Is it like Napalm or something? Is it Napalm City? There you go, come on. Oh my god, what is going on here? I don't even know what I'm looking at. This is insane. Yeah, we just need to get all of our infantry over here. All of our tanks over here. We have two nice tanks left. We need all of our support here to come up to there. We need all of our recon to come over here. We just need to do another big push. Because in the past, that's worked out pretty well. <gasps> what in the world is going on here? How are there so many? Alright, you three are going to, you know, 
give your lives in the line of duty. Oh my god, they have freaking got everything falling back. Okay, well. I mean, yeah, we gotta, we gotta do something, you know. Go ahead and let out your infantry here. Actually, except you two. I don't want you to do that. We only have a minute left? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I thought we had more time. We have to go. You can do it. You can do it. You can totally kill that flame thing. That's If we can't kill that, then we're not going to win, ever. Let's go! We did it! Okay, we gotta push, we gotta push, we gotta push. We gotta push. Go, 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 go! We just need to push with everything. Everything we got. Everything we got needs to go. There you go, there you go. If you can just come into here, we can get you to come up to here. We need you to come over to here. We should go into overtime. No, we're gonna run out of time! Come on, give me just a, a minute longer. Oh my god, this is so sad. I'm, I'm so pissed we're not gonna be able to do it just because of a time limit. Oh my god, look at this. We're bringing in our troops, and we totally, we totally had it. I'm so mad. If we had had a minute longer, we would have gotten it. We would have gotten into the buildings there. We would have pulled up our tank. We had two more big tanks coming. I'm actually so mad. But hey, we did a lot better that time. Um, that was fun. Cool. I actually had a great time with that, even though we lost. Um, so thank you guys for watching. Please go ahead and leave a like and subscribe for me. And I'll see you guys next episode. And we'll come back and we'll beat this thing once and for all. I guarantee it. Till then, bye-bye.